what is up guys this is Karan here welcome back to tech Karan youtube channel here's another android 11 based custom rooms for you we already got android 11 and android 11 custom rooms are coming day by day this time it's awaken os which is based on android version 11 right now i've installed it on my redmi note 8 it's available for redmi k20 poco f1 and maybe some other devices also and also you can install this as a gsi if you want to the link for the gsi and the bills everything is in the description so stay tuned for that and make sure to watch this video till the end we're going to find out which other things you get in this latest awaken os let's get started so guys, first of all, this ROM does not come with the Google Apps for almost all of the devices. You need to install Google Apps on your own and also it comes with the Quick Step Launcher pre-installed which has this screenshot and share option available but not the select all option as always it was expected that was available in the Pixel Launcher and if you don't know how to install Pixel Launcher in Android 11, I have a video on that. You can go and check it out that how you can install Pixel Launcher on your Android 11 so that you'll get feel of the Pixel launcher and if you go for the quick settings we don't get the 2 by 3 by default but yes if you go here and if you try to check out these kind of things you have the option to customize your columns and columns landscape even you can customize the quick bar columns and if you go for these we have the Wi-Fi we have the Bluetooth almost everything seems nicer sorry for this one we have the Wi-Fi we have the do not disturb mode we have these kind of options available sorry 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 once let me try this one once here so Wi-Fi Bluetooth in my case these are working fine here if i choose to open flashlight everything seems nice here i can also enable the hotspot from here wait let me show you by clicking here if i go here if i go for the hotspot i can enable the turn of hotspot with wi-fi so i can enable wi-fi with hotspot i can simply enable wi-fi from here and going to hotspot everything seems fine here this is very interesting thing that you can use wi-fi alongside with the hotspot so this is interesting if you go for some other things we're gonna talk about so guys, I have not installed Magisk here and if I go for the Play Store and here if I go to the settings, you can see my device is showing as certified so I can easily install banking apps and use them without any issues and this is right now I've installed it on Redmi Note 8 and this thing about this thing I'm not sure for Redmi K20 or Poco F1 because I have no idea for those but this device has the device is certified but almost everything seems same in the all devices like Awaken OS feature and some little bit of more things so yes you can install and get an idea that which are the things you get in awaken os in your device if you go for other things and if you go for the settings let me show you we have the styles and wallpapers app also as a pre-installed we own device wallpaper only have one but other things we can simply go for these wallpapers where we have a lot of wallpapers and this is app from the google play store you can simply install if it is not available for you if we go to the settings and find out some things here, everything seems nice. It has almost all Android 11 features. We have the notification history, which is of course one of my favorite features out there because Android 11 has a lot of cool kind of features. We have the bubble support. And if you're noticing, we have these icons available in the settings, which were not present in almost all Android 11. Some Android 11 has this feature, but some Android 11 does not have these kind of features, which has these kind of cool kind of icons I can see. And also if you go for the screen saver, it has the option, which is using the screen saver with the screen timeout customizations. Other things include the double tap to wake. If it is available for you, it's fine here. Also, it has a display cutout so you can hide. We have the punch hole cutout, waterfall cutout, and the notch bar killer some other things including the dark theme body fonts you can customize the fonts if you want to and we have the oneplus slate fonts which are one of my favorite fonts you can choose them but if there would be google sent medium fonts then might be great icon shape icon pack and the awaken themes awaken themes had should be some other cool kind of things but only has a single asin picker it does not include anything for your quick settings or other things so it has features but actually less features there might be more we have the sound customization storage customization privacy security etc where you have the fingerprint and you have the face lock i don't use face lock that's why i've not enabled this one but face lock is perfectly fine i've tried and tested other things include same 
One of the best features in Awaken OS includes a system navigation where you have the gesture navigation. Yes, this one is available in all Android 11s. But when you go to gesture navigation in settings, we have the option to hide the gesture bar length, which is you will you'll be able to hide the navigation bar pill from here. And then you will also know, not see this space behind the keyboard, which is one of the great things about this build. I personally like this thing in this build. And other things, we have the swipe to screenshot option by its three fingers screenshot three finger swipe screenshot you can see going to some other things we have some awaken settings as expected where you have the status bar related settings quick settings buttons notifications lock screen ambient display and miscellaneous ambient display includes some little bit of settings like double tap to check phone or lift to check phone or always on other things as miscellaneous nothing else to here customize lock screen also does not have many customizations some little bit of things available here and there notifications have only two kind of things like show headers in the notification shared because it's android 11 it should be present there automatically going for the buttons we have the advanced restart and the playback control these two options look good also the show volume panel on the left so if you go here you will see volume panel on the left side other things include the quick settings like the auto brightness icon and the new trend style nothing else like that and status bar includes the data disabled icon roaming indicator some little bit of things in clock settings but not have an enough customization but yes has enough customizations too the link for this build is in the description you can go and install that if you want to now this is all from today's video i hope you like it if you like it don't forget to like and share this video thanks for watching goodbye